Hey everybody, today we're going to take a look at the Coleman Compact Perfect Flow Lantern. Alright, so I told you in the intro it's the Coleman Compact Perfect Flow Lantern. I've had this lantern for about six years. I've used it through several power outages, mostly outside um, on our little screened in area in the back. But um, sometimes in the house, we have a very large ventilated area where we can open the doors and get cross ventilation. It's never really been a problem. It's a very small um, lantern, so the ventilation's never been an issue. Uh, it's got a single mantle. It uses the 51, number 51 style bayonet lantern um, mantles. It lights with matches or a lighter or however. You just pop the top off. You can adjust the brightness down here. And... It operates 12 hours on one of these little guys right here, and that's about I, I would say I would say mid mid brightness, not full brightness. It'll operate for about 12 to 13 hours. You got your chain here for easy carry or hanging up. Pretty sturdy chain actually. We've used this to hang it up in the back room there, and uh, that's about it. So, how do you go about doing it? Okay. Um, if you know anything about the mantles, I just changed this for the, the mantle for this video. You, you change it out, you'll burn it in, you'll light it and let it burn, and then you'll turn it on and let it go. Um, fairly simple to put on. The mantles, let me dig one out for you here, look like this. And you would pull it open like, a, like that and stick it on the, on the burner. Then you light it, let it burn, and then you light it with the gas. You don't want to light it with the gas first, you want to burn it in first. So I'm going to show you how to light this thing. Open up the top there. And this glass comes out too, so changing the mantle is real simple. This glass just slips out. You just pull it right out, snap it right back into place. I'm going to turn it on. There we go. Close that back up. And there you go. Pretty simple to operate, uh, pretty handy. Doesn't make a ton of fumes. If you've got a big open ventilated area indoors like we do between our living room and kitchen, this is perfect. It's very, very bright. That's on like one. I can get it way higher. But since you probably won't be able to tell the difference in the camera, we'll leave it at the low level for now. Um, and Coleman sold these. Gosh, I bought this in Walmart, again, about six years ago. I have a lot of LED and electronic type um, lanterns, but I decided I wanted to have something like this for camping and other situations. Um, just an extra. It's just something to figure out how to use and learn how to play with. So if I run across one with, uh, you know, dual mantles or a bigger one, I know how to use it. Um, but it actually turned out to be a really good purchase, and we used it for, uh, when we lost uh, power for two days back in 2007, I remember hanging this up in our living room. It worked great. Um, and again, our living room is right in that area where we have that cross breeze. So we were pretty cool. But uh, that's it. That's the lantern, the uh, compact perfect flow lantern. I believe they're still sold. Um... I saw them on Amazon for around $24. I think I paid $18 for this. Um, I tend to save all my old receipts for survival gear, which is actually really good to do because you see the, uh, the inflation hitting things. Um, and uh, this was about $18 bucks when I bought it. But it's a very neat, little, bright, small, compact thing. You know, so putting this some, like, in, for camping gear, sticking that in your camping gear, that's like nothing. That's, you know, tiny little nothing. It unscrews from here, and it's just this little piece up top. So that's my review for it. If you see them, um, if you want a small little lantern that runs on propane, it's well worth it. I have heard there was a conversion kit that converted this to allow you to run on the, uh, the smaller propane canisters, the short ones, but I haven't seen anything. I haven't been able to find it online. So thanks for watching, and we got a lot more videos coming up. Um, just a busy time of year for me, but we got a lot more videos coming up soon, so uh, we'll see you then.